Good to start anything, any event with a with a word of prayer, as we commit the whole night into in the hands of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Okay, let's uh, all bow our heads and close our eyes, and we're going to pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this special night, special day. It is special because we are here together to celebrate the gift of life. We thank you that uh, you have given Papa long life and it is a gift from you. Father, we thank you that you are, this is also a special day because this is the day that you have made for each one of us to be here to be a part of this celebration. From the time Papa, Papa Nieto was born, your grace and love endures forever. Your grace and love never fails. And Lord, for this, we, we, each one of us, we are glad and we rejoice and will continue to rejoice. Father, tonight, we ask for your blessing 
upon this gathering. Let this night be filled with peace, with joy, and let your presence fill this place. That every conversation will bring you glory and honor. Unto you, we give you praise, we give you glory, we give you honor. In Jesus' name we pray, and everyone say, Amen. 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 Thank you, Teacher Johnny. On behalf of um, my parents, your time and of your effort of coming here so that you can celebrate with us. It truly is uh, a time of thanksgiving for the Lord has given you long life and we pray that you will continue to live for as long as the Lord wills. And we thank you so much that you are a very special part of his life and has always been over the years. And so we would like for this part of the program to give you an idea of Papa's life over the last 90 years. And uh, I'd like to call my mom to help me with this. It's a PowerPoint presentation, and it's called Papa's Life Story. Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Thank you for being here to help us celebrate Papa's Day. Uh, 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 Yes. <laughs> oh. And uh, uh, he was born in Santa Fe, San Marcelino, San Blades, Philippine High School, where we both went. Is, uh, Papa first took a course in. Mala. What was that? Radio Technician. Yeah, he <laughs> uh, wanted to be a radio. Technician, and he so he took uh, a radio technician course, uh, but then uh, he thought oh, that's not good enough. So he what's that, Papa? Oh, of course in Manila. And uh, then uh, he went to regular four-year college in electrical. Oh, still no glasses, huh? <laughs> he still looks very young. He, Papa passed the required work examination for electrical engineers. He got married. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, he already was starting to wear glasses. That means he probably was becoming worse. Look at me. And, uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Oh! Uh, you know, I think this was taken in Bangkok when Papa was working in Bangkok. And uh, when I visit him, here, there. When you take the plane, and you just go to another, you have to be dressed up. Yeah. You dress up, you have to be in Coke and Thai. And we go to the airport, because those are the four kids. This was two years ago. Two years ago. Oh, Papa is 90 years old. And you know what? I'm 92. But look at us. Oh, this is in Saigon. You know, Papa also worked in Saigon for three years. The, the thing there, it's so hot. Oh, I suffered of some, some burns in my feet. Because I cannot complain because he warned me. Don't, uh, don't complain, huh? Because I might, uh, <laughs> uh, something might happen to them. Anyway, um, Papa is that in Saigon also. Uh, Papa, as an electrical engineer, he was always working on plants and that, that's his special design, electrical engineer. Papa was an electrical engineer in his entire professional career in the Philippines, Thailand, Vietnam, Guam, Saipan, Hawaii, and America. Uh, I worked in after the first 13 years. That is 1975. <laughs> I tell you, Papa, this? Uh, these are 22 years apart. This thing here, this one, Papa retired in 2007. Uh, he, he was about something to do. And he kept himself busy with. And enjoying our family. Uh, we are 32 all in all in our family. For two, 
And look at this. So this is Edna's family. So we are just wedding. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Then, oh, here. Oh, the Jedos, uh, Ariel and Hilda, uh, they are in Portland. And baby, here's the, oh, baby Maika, that's their first grandchild. Our great grandchild. That's Maika. Now, who is this? Helen's family in Virginia. Yeah. This is Corina and Ben. Yeah. Uh, they are our great grandchildren. Uh, uh, and then this one. Oh, Lillian's family here, and they're here to go, oh, look at the boy. <laughs> in Arizona. Oh, look at Sarila. And Sunny. And Dorothy. Dorothy is a doctor. That's the Oh, okay. that's Nick. Hi, Nick. In Portland, Oregon. No children. Christian and uh, Noel. No. Uh, I need Ginger. And that's me, Papa, Ariel, Benon, and Maika. Those are the neighbors. Very family. Yeah, that is Portland. Oh, hey. Oh, Dr. Lendoy, do you recognize your family? Yes, yes. Where, where, where? Where was this? Papa, oh, Dr. Lendoy. He has been helping us for the last two years. And then what is this? Is that something? Where was this? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's me. Oh, it's so fun. Oh, you're the best yourself, Yeah. Oh, that was my very nice party. Uh, more and more extended family friends. More and more. Hey, what's that? <laughs> my granddaughter. E. Wow. Oh, we're made by Neo, isn't he? Oh, okay, Neo. I'm there. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for you. Ariel was born. Papa has been um, a Mason from then on, all the way till now. Once a Mason, always a Mason. And uh, that has been uh, one of his um, uh, favorite activities as well, getting involved in all the activities of the local lunch and the different other lodges, wherever he was, he was always a member of that. Unfortunately, I, I don't have pictures of that part, so I'm sorry I didn't put that in there. But I did want to mention that um, he is a very devoted mason. Okay, so now we come to the part of uh, paying tribute to Papa.